as a Ugandan, this is so cool to see. Just, I'm somewhere in Jamaica and I'm seeing Ghana flag being painted on a kiosk. I think this is so cool, man. Look at that. Ghana! That's amazing, man. It's amazing to see. Ah, it's locked up. The Ghana flag. So, this is for you good? Mm -hmm. This is for George, right? For Charles. Charles. Charles or George? Okay. Charles. So this is for Charles. Apparently this one place used to be the ocean. The sea used to be here. So what happened? opened up it goes back and some over over more than half of the city so and then this particular area the sea went away the biggest trades they were involved in which was the illegal tra trafficking of Africans at, at that time and so just as in Ghana where they used to have the dungeons for the enslaved Africans and then have the chapel on top of it and then have the governor's quarters at the top it's a similar blueprint they use here so we saw in there um, the quarters for the, for the, the, the command officer um, if we could see what was buried below I'm sure we would find dungeons either for officers or for enslaved Africans as well as, as, a, as a chapel because they, they like to pray to their God before they walk on our heads and enslave us. What, what, what are we doing? Are you walking on what used to be at the bottom? <laughs> no, of the sea? no, no. I'm not yeah. walking on water, man. This is a miracle. You know, Jamaica sits on the same fault line as um, Haiti. Mm. And so it's so interesting that, you know, Haiti has been hit by earthquakes that have caused devastation. Um, um, you know, many of them over the years. We have been lucky. We talk about the 1692 earthquake that destroyed Port Royal. And we talk about the 1907 earthquake that hit Kingston. Um, just a few months ago in October, we had one of our biggest earth tremors. You know, really an earthquake in a long time. And it's so funny how many Jamaicans remark that boy looked like we're overdue for another earthquake. <laughs> but uh, when is the next available flight? <laughs> <laughs> where, where are we right now? Playmont Avenue. Playmont Avenue, we're still in Kingston, right? Yes. I mean, where are we? Whose house is this? This is where uh, the location of Peter Tosh used to live in in the 80s. Peter Tosh? Peter Tosh, great Peter Tosh. And he was murdered. Yeah? This is a great he, was, he was murdered right here. Did you guys know that this is where Peter Tosh used yeah. to live? This is incredible, man, because I remember people were telling me that you've been to the last resident of. Uh, for Mali, you've never been to the last resident of Peter Tosh. So will this be the last resident? Uh, you know, there's a place in Westmoreland. It's a place in Westmoreland. Oh, okay. But this is where he was murdered. May your soul rest in perfect peace, man. But this is a very beautiful house. I guess it's it's no longer for him again. Probably it, it's sold. What do you know about this house? Let me know in the comment section. Yeah. It's so cool to know that this is the neighborhood where Peter Tosh used to live, man. It's very peaceful. Jamaica is beautiful, man. Look at that. Just look at that, man. Like, it's kind of like a, a rich neighborhood, man. 
really rich anyway i'll see you guys in the next one peace out